Okay, so... Not sure what that means. Not good, at least. Ah! I don't want to be part of this anymore! gonna resurrect there not using a resurrect there so close to a, an idol <laughs> shocking says CK <laughs> um, can I sneak them somehow somewhere I mean, the game tends to have, like, spots that you can... What happens if we drop down here? We instantly take damage. Okay. Not what I was hoping for. Darn it. Can you heal me? Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Do, 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 do. Has to be a secret way we can use so we can. Oh, yes. We can backstab them. Well, they can backstab us. has some heavy armor on, dude. Will this allow us to climb even higher up? Uh, oh, can he get up here? Get down here, dude. Like, I don't want to fight you up there where the other one guy can see us. Double lightning reversal. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoa. Did not expect that. Oh boy. But man, those... Oh, hi little dude. Lightning reversals feels amazing when you pull it off. Can I come down and play? Oh, come on. How could you deal that much damage just from falling off a cliff? Onto me? Like, wow. Is there anything at all here? Or am I just... Lost. Yep, yeah, doesn't seem to be anything whatsoever. What a weird little place. I was sure there was going to be some loot down here, but... Nope. Okay, up we go again. <laughs> I 
But Gex is green! And doesn't he wear, like, sunglasses? I can tell you for sure these guys weren't sunglasses or a secret agent. Never played that game, though. But I remember when I was younger that I wanted to because I was so into platformers when I was young. Oh, okay. What? Why? Oh, is this like... There's loot up there. Are we gonna go up onto the highest cliff? That would be so cool. Dragon Spot Droplet. I can't remember which platforms I played as younger. I didn't have an N64, but I played a lot of Mario 64 at a play friend's place. And then... I myself played a lot of, like, Super Mario, of course, on my SNES. And then... On PlayStation I bought the first Spyro the Dragon, but I never actually played the second and third one uh, up until now when they remastered them for the current consoles. Um, wow, we are at the Sanctuary. Holy cow. Is this like it? No, it can't be. I refuse. I'm acknowledging that this would be like the end of the game. Has to be something else. Anyway, let's rest. Uh, didn't play Rayman Legends, but I played Rayman Origins when it first came out. That's a really good platformer, yeah. Totally agree. Very fun. But my favorite platformer of like <laughs> that I enjoyed. Celeste was also really good last year actually. If you haven't played that one, that's a really good platformer. And I myself am a big fan of Super Meat Boy. Okay. Are you alive? Oh, I thought the last one was the the divine realm. Um. What the actual? Old dragon. Old. Whoa. Okay. Um. Whoa. Um. They seem to be spewing poison, so I'm gonna do this. Transistor. You mean the game from the Bastion creators? I think that's called Transistor. 
That's really awesome. The girl running around with the talking sword and everything. Really good. Haven't played their latest game though. What's it called? Py Fire? Pyre? Pyre, I think. I haven't played that one. Uh, okay, let's focus on this. This. We get. Hmm. Should I? Holy cow! Look at those smoke effects! That is amazing! Oh crap, get out, get out, get out! Oh, I can't... I kill them the health actually goes down so I'm doing something right this reminds me a little bit of the I can't remember the names of them. The something of the up in the Cathedral of the Deep in Dark Souls 3, there was like this boss with many enemies, but you had to look for a special, like one specific one. Ow! This is just kill all of them. Oh, hang on, why are you... Oh, are they losing, like, their power because... Or is it the white ones that I need to kill? And the dark ones has already been killed. Oh, crap. Should have ran. I think so. Final one, maybe? Second phase? I'm guessing? Think this is the final boss CK? I don't know. Might be. Pretty epic at least. Okay, I think you're right. Holy cow! That is so beautiful! And I'm so effing day Oh yeah, Divine Dragon. Whoa! <laughs> Holy shit! Get out of there! Can, I don't know where I'm at. Like, should I be going for him like this? What's happening? Can I shoot him? Ow! Uh, need to heal? Oh, wow. Oh, am I meant to... Oh, is that like... Since there's lightning in these those trees... Oh, wow. Ow. 
Okay, jump that. So if I jump this... Huh. There's something about that, at least. Shock. Okay, okay. I see what they want me to do here. And thrown away. There we go, okay. We'll see if the game actually turns out to be like, ow, it's over and I beat the game, or if it will actually allow me like some other Souls game that, oh, you can still explore the world, collect secrets and all that. That should have been like almost, uh... oh, there we go, more lightning. Gonna dodge one more here and then go, oh, wrong one, want this one, here we go. Phew. Oh boy. Going well, going well. Am I supposed to run up to him? Oh. This is oh, ow. Ow. That's bad. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. And it blows us away again. I don't know. Gain that posture. And wait, can I go into this and camera? Hello. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now! And it's kind of bullshit. Oh! Wait, then there was no lightning! Dude! You gotta give me lightning if I'm supposed... To, I'm gonna be able to actually do something. Okay, and lightning, there we go. Okay, he just took away the trees in it. Okay, run up the sword, dude, run up the sword. We wanted dragon tears. I wouldn't call that a gracious gift, but okay. <laughs> did it. And I didn't die. I ran out of... Oh, wow. Memory, divine dragon. Commune with the, uh, the divine dragon. Ancient deity. Of the ever blossom divine dragon's tears tears received from the divine dragon the gracious gift of tears can only be granted by the mortal blade the body of the divine dragon is eternal and its tears once shed will maintain their form and moisture in per perpetuate perpetuity should one of the dragon's heritage per partake of the dragon's tears immortal severance will be reified um does this end? Like, no, wait, what? What's happening? Has someone taken Kuro? Genichiro. Yeah, I'm betting Genichiro is the new big bad.
Wow, what a battle. That was awesome. Easy. Like, but awesome. And I'm guessing this is Lord Achina, yeah? Or what it's called. So they took Kuro again, did they? Ishin Lord Ishin, that's right. Nonigoto. But why was he holding his sword? Secret passage key. The key to the secret passage that leads out of Ashina Castle. The secret passage can be found at the end of the moat in the Ashina Reservoir, not far from the Moonview Tower. Kuro has escaped the castle through this passage and the wolf looks to join him there. Oh, that is definitely the end. The secret passage we escaped through at the beginning of the game where we lost our arm to Genichiro and probably will fight him again. That's so epic. Oh my god. Yeah, take care, New Matrix. Thanks for being here and checking it out. クロ様はその抜け穴から城外へ脱し、ススキの原で、あなたを待っているはず。シルグロスカント。わかった。一心様の命にて、ヨタカの衆が目印の呪しを屋根上に置いています。ヨタカの呪しを辿り、クロ様
Hang on a minute. You're onto something there, CK. Uh, after killing the rats, he gives us the... Not the temple arts, the Ashina arts. So maybe it's the Ashina cross? That he wants us to complete this tree. And with that, we will be ready. Or a secret skill, does that mean like you need to have completed one, one skill tree completely for me to give you this? And I'm working my way up to this one because I want Living Force. Like, oh my god, I want that one. Could buy this one. Slash Reversal. Or maybe there are prosthetics that might be better actually. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the upper path first, so... But okay. She wants us, though, to go up here and follow the rooftops. Like, oh. Okay, maybe not then. We can't... We can't even get out here. So the castle is completely on lockdown, apparently. But also, it's kind of silly because going to the abandoned dungeon entrance, you have the bridge, like you have Ashina Reservoir right above you, so you can probably pretty much just jump down and you're down there at the secret like escape route. So the route to the end isn't that long, but I'm wondering, like, why has it reset again? Are there new enemies and new mini-bosses, since I haven't filled my vitality completely yet? We have all the gourd seeds from these, but... So yeah, I think I'm, I'm gonna go to the Dilipitated Temple and we will replay the game. No, just... Take a look at what's different in the starting area, if there's new things, or... I'm gonna see if... Nope, currently empty. I'm gonna... when I'm done with the game, I'm gonna have to look up what's up with that... ...box. What it actually does. Like, what items might be missable in the game that will spawn there, I wonder. Where is he? This is weird. So weird. See, I need to buy these two, then I can... Oh, right! I can actually read up on all of these now. So what are they? Lazulite Shuriken. Shuriken blessed with the favor of the Fountainhead Lapis Lazuli. Cause spirit emblems to use. Its piercing edge heavily damages vitality and damages vitality and posture even if guarded. These blades do not slow down even after striking an enemy. The last light blue trait of light it emits in flight it is re reminiscent of a shooting star. Very cool, very cool. Throw extremely sharp last light shuriken. Its piercing edge heavily damages vitality and damages vitality and posture even if guarded. Bring the shuriken to a powerful spin before throwing hits enemy multiple times. Okay, so it's just a really good upgrade. I want that one. I want it badly. All of these require lapis lazuli. Okay, so Lazulite Sabimaru. Sabimaru blessed with the favor of the fountainhead lapis lazuli. The combination lapis lazuli and the rusted blue blade produces a poisonous mist with every swing. Dissolving the lapis lazuli over the blade caused the ancient blue rust to bubble th to the blade's surface. So he has a stronger 
poison to it. Wow, that's really, really good also. Lazulite Axe. The hefty Lazulite Blade inflicts damage even on guarding enemies. The sound of the Lapis Lazuli Blade striking home creates a powerful reverberation capable of dispelling enemy illusions. Wow. That's really cool. So it's like a Snapseed built into it. A flame burn less with the favor, yeah. Uh, damages even apparitions with its blazing purple flame. This flame does not, however, inflict burn status abnormality. The sacred lapis lazuli fires are divine. Cleanse the deep-seated hatred with flame. Okay, a continuous spray of holy flame before you. Release a blast of holy flame before you. Okay, okay. So, yeah, these two I really want. But I think I'm using the shurikens much more than the Sabimaru. And I'm already so close to getting this. So I'm going to aim on that. And that's like six and a half K. Yeah, I'm not surprised the game has multiple endings because yeah, Dark Souls 1, 2, 3 and Bloodborne has different endings like two or three different endings depending on things and new game plus tends to be normal within the games the only question is like they tend to do new game plus differently i know that new game plus in dark souls 2 i remember i can't remember three yeah three also is that you can finish the game you can beat the final boss and the game is like oh okay now explore the world and look for secrets that you have, haven't have found and beat enemies you haven't defeated yet and all that good stuff. Then you can walk up to like an NPC or something and be like, yeah, I want to start New Game Plus now because I'm done with everything. Dark Souls 1 though and Bloodborne, for example, they are just like, oh, you beat the final boss. Here's New Game Plus. So when I beat Bloodborne my first time, I had so many like areas I hadn't explored yet i wanted to like oh i'm gonna go back and try to you know, take a look in them and find secrets and all that but then i accidentally got to the final boss and i was like oh i'm gonna just try this one and then i'll go back but i beat him on my first try so i was like oh maybe hopefully i can go back still but no so the game is restarted on new game plus and i was like oh and i had missed like a complete area of the game and lots of things so i was a bit you know salty about that so i'm not so sure how they're gonna handle new game plus in sekiro i hope that if i by accident like go to the final battle and beat it they will still allow me to keep on playing and maybe like talk to kuro or emma and be like yeah i want to restart the game now and have it more difficult but win new things or new enemies or more difficult enemies and stuff like that but with more skill points as rewards hmm so we need a lot of cash and we need those things the fulminated mercury i wanted to do this off stream but i think we need to visit the what happens if we pray here now? Is this just to go back to the dream world? Let's try it. Yeah, okay. So... Um, Alright, we can't go to him. can go to this guy though see if he has anything hmm. trying to remember where all the there was one merchant down there and there's one out at Mibu village I need to see if any of them sells fulminated 
like powder or what it was called. Um, those are enemies. Where are there we go. Hi. Goku. Uh, sure. Yeah, nope. Nothing here. Because I need two more, and that way I can upgrade my shurikens, and I really want that, like, badly. It would be great to have at least one prosthetic tool all the way up to its final version. Right, make the monkey dance and he'll be eaten. Okay, I still haven't sold this one yet. I'm so far into the game now that... I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to solve that one without being a boring streamer and look it up on the internet. Oh, he dropped scrap iron. Sweet. Thanks, dude. Goku. So, do you have... No, yellow gunpowder, black gunpowder, scrap iron. I feel like maybe the merchant like that wanted help on the battlefield might get rare things like that in case I I would have managed to help him. But I never sold the mystery either about oh. Who, who can help him? So, hmm. Because FromSoft likes to do that, like hide good things in a chop or something if you complete a storyline for a character. Guy in the river where you were? What do you mean, CK? Which guy in the river? Yeah, I don't know the with the monk. I found out that he, like, I showed him the white pinwheel. And he wanted to get spirited away, so I used like the prosthetic tool, what's it called? The Divine Abduction. Because of the... It telling like... However, it is said that one can only return from being spirited away once, and if taken again, there is no coming back. So yeah, I did that, and he just vanished up in smoke, like screaming, and then he's gone. And I don't know where he's at. Oh, he respawns, actually. Up in the room. Okay, okay, so that's the farming guy that you spoke of. Okay. I was thinking you meant someone that, that could buy these fulminated things. Oh, right, I have, an, have a memory from the dragon we should be... Should, we should use. No, it's attack power. Confront memory, divine dragon. Ba -ba -da -bong. The battle memory of an extraordinary foe, although distant, recollection of such a memory provided sustenance for the world. The divine dragon of the Everblossom came from the west long ago, eventually making its way to this land. Some parts of Ashna are exceedingly old, water coursing through her ancient rocks and soil allow the dragon to take root. That was the most badass dragon I have seen within a video game like ever. 
好嘢啊！